one of the things that sets city care apart is that they have almost all in-house capability. With city care, they actually cover the gambit. They've got their own drainage people, their own engineers, they have their own landscape people. You can move within the organisation into different roles. Not many people realise that city care is a 24-7 business. Um, waterways plays its part in the flood response and we've got to go out and make sure that the rivers and up and drains are working properly. It's good hard work but it's the fun work. You'll find a lot of the public um, loves to say oh you council workers to city care which is a big myth. Um, we're owned by shareholders. I talk to families and friends and they still see us as sitting under the council but once I talk to them show them what we do they actually understand now that we're an independent company and we're delivering the best service that we can to the council and also to the public. Not a lot of people actually realise that City Care have a building division. So this is a new Marston School site. Uh, City Care Building Construction have been contracted to build the entire project from ground to handover. This is the building itself. From outside we've developed all the fields, coming through all the landscape and coming through into the internal building to what you see now, one of the open plan learning areas. This playground is actually a key part to get people back into the centre of the city. There's a great deal of personal satisfaction from all these people working on this project. It's something that people who've worked on it will bring their children to, telling them how they single-handedly built this, uh, this wonderful playground. There's a lot of training opportunities, so they put you through heaps of training courses and that kind of thing, and they look after you well. Whether it's just getting your driver's licences and progressing through your basic things, or going through for national certificates and progressing your career. We're very open. There's not much hierarchy. If, if there's a way the job can be done easier, then it doesn't matter where you are in that team, you're encouraged to speak up. All City Care guys, we do toolbox meetings in the morning for health and safety. Everybody on site will have an input. <laughs> We're at West Mountain, Wellfield Subdivision, just getting the trenches prepared for the services. It's a fairly big site. You stand in one corner, it's a K from one way and then a K the other. We're chasing the farm around as we go. He's still got his livestock in here. I like being there out in the real life stuff and at the end of the job you can drive through it and see what you've done. There's a good achievement there, eh? We look for people who are professional, can do the job and um, will fit in with the team. You're actually joining a family. You look after each other, you've got to show a bit of commitment and, and when you do that City Care definitely gives you the opportunity and you can go far. We are uh, definitely a nationwide company, there's more offices in the North Island and the South. I think City Care offers a lot more that other companies don't and the infrastructure we've got, just, it just makes it all worthwhile. And it's still as though you're going somewhere. In the 2013-14 season, I won Auckland Cricket's Groundsman of the Year award. With cricket pitches, we have to spend a lot of time preparing them. Working for City Care, they give you the resources to do the best possible job you can. The majority of the guys treat these spaces like their own back lawn. So if you wouldn't bring your child into this environment, you can't expect the public to do the same. Within the time we've been here, we've um, received many accolades and awards for that hard work that the guys have put in. It's a great environment, so uh, they talk about better work stories. This is one of those places, yeah.